We take the security of your AutoWork Online account very seriously. In order to improve your account security, we have recently made changes to the way you log in and manage your passwords. The new enhanced login screens will now provide better feedback to aid your login and password recovery. On the login screen you can now tick Remember Me and this will store your username. You should only use this feature if you are the only person that uses this particular computer. We also do not recommend that you allow your browser to save your password as this will allow anyone with access to your computer to log in. To protect your account it will be locked after five unsuccessful login attempts. In order to unlock your account you can reset your password or contact support who will be more than happy to assist you. If you have forgotten your password or need to reset your account click the forgot password option. You can then enter your username or the recovery email. An email will then be sent to your address associated with your username. If you have not yet associated an email address with your username, it will be sent to the registered email address of the AutoWork Online account. Once you enter the email address or your username, you'll see this notification saying that an email has been sent. Once you have received the email, click on the link provided and follow the instructions to change your password. You can see that there are guidelines listed that help you create a more secure password. Type in your new password. Any password you've previously used you won't be allowed to use again for a period of time. After you've changed your password you'll be asked to log in again. In order to manage your account, you need to go into the new My Account screen in the database section. This section allows you to change passwords and set the password recovery emails. This replaces the old change password screen. To manage a user, you must first unlock it. Enter the current password for that user and hit the unlock button. This will then give you the option of entering a new password or entering an email address. You will then get a verification email sent to your new email address. You must verify the email you received by clicking the link before it can be used for a password recovery. Please note that the email address must be unique to this one username. In order to change your password on the database My Account screen, just hit the Change Password button. This will take you back to a similar screen that we saw earlier to change the password, where you have the guide to a more secure password and the option to enter the password and then confirm a new one. For your security, the user and or the system administrator will be sent a notification email when a password or password recovery email is changed. Alternatively, if you're struggling to recover your password or account, then please contact the support department who can assist in resetting your password for you. We recommend you do this via email or using your business landline so that your identity can be easily verified. If you call from a mobile or a number we do not have on file, we may need to call you back on your standard business number. If you receive an email notification that you did not expect, please contact support as soon as possible. I do hope you found this short video useful and thanks for watching. If you would like to be kept up to date with the ongoing developments at MAM Software, then please follow us on social media, YouTube and our community portal.